Hello and welcome back to my Final Fantasy 12 Let's Play. Okay, so I wanted to do something where we just kind of quickly show off the Espers with their final attacks. I know in this playthrough I had mentioned multiple times I wanted to show off the Espers more. Um, and then, as usual, I didn't do it. So, that's a little disappointing, obviously. Um, oh, I need to turn off their gambits. Okay, let's, let's not do that. Okay, so, I don't know how long these guys will last, but I'm just going to do... Okay, so let's do... So, Bellius, we've already seen Bellius, um, but for the sake of this, we'll, we'll, we'll do that as well. I don't know if he'll just one-shot him. Um, so what I think I'm going to do is I'm going to try to make... Uh, I'm going to try to make him... Oh, it would help if I selected him. Okay, so we'll see what he has. So he's got Cura. He's got Fyra. Okay, so kind of lower uh, stuff there. And then Techniques, Pain Flare is his normal attack. And Hellfire is his main attack. I'm going to assume this is just going to automatically kill this guy, so let's see. Oh, it didn't. Okay. So, oh, I should slow this down. Okay, so, oops. Okay, here we go. Hellfire. And I'm just going to show off all their special attacks, basically, because I feel like this is something that... People just don't use a lot. Or maybe it's just me. It could just be me, honestly. They're so amazingly well done. It seems like a shame that we don't we don't see it. The music's cool as well. The animation and the visuals are just absolutely stellar, even for a game that's older these days. It still looks pretty pretty awesome. Wow, that didn't even fully kill him. That is that is actually kind of funny. Okay. Oops, what, what, what are we doing here? Missed. You know what? Let's let's experiment. If I summon Mateus, can I just run around? Because I use them so little, I don't even know if that's how it works. Okay, so what do we have for Mateus? So we've got Cura, Blizzara. Okay, that's that's pretty good. And then techniques. So Flash Freeze is the I would say the regular target like hit, and then Frost Weave looks like the massive one. So let's see the regular attack. I'll just let her. Okay, so that's the mat. That's the regular one. Okay, so yeah, they're still out. Let's go find another target. This could be pretty fun, actually. Where you going, buddy? Come here. Okay, now. Oops. Uh, we're going to go ahead and do the Frost Weave. We're going to see what that looks like. It's probably just like when we fought her, but let's just see what it looks like anyways. Maybe it's something different. Oh, this is definitely different. Wow. Wow. You know, I'm embarrassed to say, I don't think I have ever seen this. That's how often I use these. Wow, that was really quite good. Very cool. Okay. Amazing. Okay, so that is uh, everything that he has access to, I believe, right? Yes. Okay, so now let's, uh, let's switch over to this bro. All right, so Ultima is a three bar, so we'll have to reset for that one. Uh, so let's do Add Remelch. Yeah, I really should have used this more. It's kind of a shame. So I can see he's got he's got Faith automatically. Uh, what does he got? He's got Cura. He's got Thundara, uh, which would obviously make sense. And then he's got Flash Arc for his regular thing and Judgment Bolt. Okay. Wow, that's pretty good damage, actually. 7,000? Okay, cool, cool. I th that's probably based on my stats. 
All right, now let's go ahead and let's do the big boy on this one. Yeah, so this might be a shorter episode. I just want to showcase all these because I just feel like they still, even with the revamp, uh, for they stay out longer. Um, I don't know if they do more damage, but they stay out longer and they, uh, they're more resistant or something. They, they went through a pretty massive change. Wow, that is absolutely amazingly gorgeous. That's really quite good. Very cool stuff. I hate that I didn't use them a bit more. Okay, cool. Now that didn't even kill that guy, so this is actually a good guy to reset on, probably. Okay, cool. Now let's see what we have. Okay, we can't we can't do Ultima, so we'll have to come back to Ultima. So let's see about Fran. There's a chap right, right behind us. I didn't give Fran a single summon. Wow, that's okay. Um, all right. Well, let's go, uh, let's run back real quick. We'll get our charges back, and we'll finish Balthira, then we'll swap the other party in and do those. Wow, did I walk right past it? Apparently so. Uh-oh. Oh, you know what? Ah, I'm just gonna kill this guy. Hello? Get this guy out of here. Just gonna annoy us. Don't dispel. Oh my god, it's so annoying. Okay. Here we go. Ultima, baby. Now, this one should be awesome. A, a three thingy, whatever they call that. Okay, so let's quickly look. What can they do? Oh, we've got a renew. Fully restores HP to allies in range. Wow, that's pretty good. And then holy, heavy holy damage, as well as redemption is the normal attack, and whatever that is, is the ultra attack. Okay, so that did what? About, uh, did about 12,000. Of course, I have it going fast, so that's not ideal. Okay, now let's see. Oh, and they got reflex status. Very good. I just noticed that as well, so like the buffs. Man, these animations are awesome. kill that's funny okay so obviously when you use that they go bye-bye um, oh I forgot Bosch was berserk from before okay well that's a little, uh, a little disappointing can you not do that please Bosch It would be amazing if you didn't do that. Alright, now. Now we can actually go over here and continue our showcase. Okay, so let's go ahead and do this guy. I, I'm not even going to try to pronounce that name, but okay. Okay. Okay, so his is so he's got reflex status. I can see that right out of the gate. He can do cure curaja. Well, wow, that's pretty good. Okay. He has bio. Okay, that makes sense considering. And then blight is his big one. So let's see what his normal attack does. And then okay, there it is. Cool. Oops, that is not what I want. Let's let's. Let's select the correct stuff here. All right, let's do the big boy now and see what happens. As far as damage goes, I'm sure there are ways you can buff damage in this, but I just want to see the visuals of this because I, I find this pretty interesting, honestly. 
maybe you guys have never seen all this stuff either. Wow, that's not what I expected to see. That's pretty amazing, actually. Wow. Very interesting. Oh, restore. Nice. That actually helps us. That's, that's great. Okay, so that was him. What am I doing? Why do I keep going to the wrong ones? All right. So now, holy moly, she's got a lot. Okay, she's... Wow. Um, okay. Well, we'll just start at the top, I guess. I'll do Hashmel and then Zalara, and then we'll come back for the other... Well, that's... I can't believe she has six, but it must have been she was the best pick for all of them, with the exception of one, obviously, that I need to redo, but whatever. All right, let's, let's do some Hashmel. So this is a story guy. Now, what does he have? Kiraja, Kirajo, I should say. Grabaga, okay. Reduce HP of all foes in range by half of the target's max HP. That could be pretty useful. And then Rockshore is his normal. He's earth-based. And Gia's Wraith, Wraith. See, I just happen to know some of these are like there are all kinds of varying things as to how much damage they're going to do, right? So, like, you can build for it. So that's not a lot of damage, but, you know, we're, that's not really why we're doing this. We just want to want to check it out. Oh, now he has... Oh, I was going to say, now he has black magic? No, he does not. Okay. Let's do Giga's Wrath or whatever that is. Okay, now that healed him. That was actually good for us because <laughs> we're just using this guy to show everything off. So, very cool. Okay. Let's do Zalara next. This is this is kind of neat. I really wish I would have used more of these. Okay. Oh, gosh. He's just casting kill. Okay, well, that, that could put a damper on our showcase, but okay. Um, wow, so he has Cura. He has Warp, he has Death, which is what he's casting, and then he has Kill, which is a, a technique, and Condemnation. So let's see what this looks like. Let's see if it actually lands. It did. Wow. Okay. Yeah, you see the little time down at the bottom? No, I don't want you doing that, brother. Even though... Wow, I mean, you could just walk around with this guy and absolutely murder everything. Here's the here's the big one. Yes, I can honestly say, I don't know that I've ever gone through all of these. In the in all of the time I've put into this game, I haven't even seen most of these. Wow. That's unbelievable. Alright, well I guess we'll just do this one next. Very cool stuff so far. Alright, and what do we have here? Kiraja, Shock, heavy damage to one foe, and then his normal one is Devour Soul and then Soul Purge, so we'll, we'll check this out first. Okay, that almost killed him, so let's just go ahead and uh, let's see if we can do the Soul Purge. Oh, we must he must have done uh, Kamikaze. That's a little annoying, but alright. Let's go find something else to murder, shall we? Alright, here it is.
That's cool. Yeah, I can I can safely say I've never seen that one either. Uh Okay. Why I feel like that might be a glitch. <laughs> I don't know, that's just my uh just my guess. I feel like that might be a glitch. Okay, maybe if I zone I'll be okay. That saved. Okay, good. I'm glad that that we're okay now. That's great. Okay, what did we have any other ones with him? No, we did not. So we'll go back to Ash. So we'll do Famfrit. So and then we'll go into Chaos, uh, Exodus, and Zodiac. Actually, let's let's start with Pinello because she only has one other one to do. Zerkadromus. Oh, this guy definitely, I'm pretty sure, can can do really high damage if certain conditions are met. All right, let's. Uh, wait, am I past warning? Yeah, I am. Okay, now I'm not. All right, so he has Curaja, Scourge, okay, F inflicts sap and heavy damage to all foes in range, and then Gravity Walls is normal attack. What does that say? Deal damage based on the difference between the user's current and the max HP of one foe, and then this one is the same thing, I think. Yeah, so that's how you can you can maximize his damage if you if you're doing things right, basically, but. We're obviously not going to do that, so. Okay, so that's not much damage, but again, if you go into this and you know what you're doing, this guy can do some ridiculous damage. But this won't be impressive as far as, like, numbers are concerned right now, because everybody's, like, cured, I'm pretty sure. Well, like, let's say you give him bubble, and then you take him down to 1 HP, and then you cast this or something like that. Uh, that could be massive damage. If I understand it correctly, that is. Visually, pretty amazing. Per usual. Excellent. I didn't even catch what the numbers were, but it's, I mean, it's kind of irrelevant. Alright, now. Who's the next one we're going to do? Famfrit? Alright, let's do that one next. Wow, they double got us there. It's not very nice. This is going well, actually. Okay, so... He has Renew. Fully restore the HP of all allies in range. That's, that's pretty good. Um, and then his normal attack is this. Brinny Canade? Canade? Cannonade and Tsunami, I'm assuming is what that is. Okay, so we'll see the normal attack. Wow, that murdered him. Okay, nice. And now let's do the big boy. This is one of the story guys we got. Pretty sure. Oh, yeah, that was cool. Obviously water-based. You can see how incorporating some of these into your uh, gameplay with the right elements could be really massive. We used Bel uh, Bellius against something that was casting fire a lot, so that was supposedly pretty good. I don't remember. I think it went okay. It was uh, against a hunt. I don't recall which hunt it was, but... Okay, wow, that killed him. Cool. Alright, so now basically we're down to... We have to do Chaos, Exodus, and Zodiac. Those are our last three. We'll just have to run back and forth. That's why I'm, I'm here at a, at a crystal, so it's just easier to reset, essentially. If it wasn't obvious. All right, let's uh, let's go ahead and bully our uh, our poor little little. What is this guy called? Our poor little shield worm. 
Let's pull chaos out. We'll see how we do with that. Okay, well, why do I always forget? Okay, there we go. All right, so he has reflect. You'll notice that didn't wake up the shield worm. So this, I mean, if you have a ranged uh, Esper, this could actually be something you do. Okay, renew. So that's pretty good. Aroga. So obviously he's wind based, if I had to guess. Yep. Whirlwind is his normal attack, and we've already seen that. And then tornado. Let's do that. Let's see if this wakes him up. I don't even know if it will. Man, this looks so cool. Never seen this one either. Uh, at least not that I remember anyways. I mean, I guess it's possible that I saw this stuff back when it was on PS2. That did not even wake him up. That's absolutely amazing. Okay, great. Now let's go get our stuff back. Our charges, basically. Man, those, those animations, the animation work on this game really was top-notch. He's still sleeping. That's, that's great. Okay, so that was Chaos, right? So let's do Exodus now. Okay, that was the Comet. Now he came in hasted immediately, so that's something to note. Has Kirajo, okay. Arcane, he's got Arador, okay. That does massive fire damage to all foes in range. Alrighty. Comet is his normal attack, and we'll just go in. I'll let him do one more Comet, just so you can see it slower. Boop. Wow, oh, that one did a lot, okay. Hopefully he'll restore, but this will probably kill him. Maybe not though, who knows. So do your meter, Meteor. Or your, yeah, Meteor, that's correct. I, th I think we got this guy up on the hill in the, the high waist. Please, I believe this is where this guy was. Pretty sure. Yep, I don't remember this one either. That's going to leave a mark, for sure. He survived? He did. Congratulations, buddy. Okay. I'm proud of him. See, that's that's the only downside. These, these super, like, ultimate attacks. Maybe I did do it on the PlayStation 2, and I just, re I just felt like... They just don't do enough damage. If they can't even kill a normal monster, I could have killed this guy in seconds with my weapons. So what would be the point of summoning, you know? That's what I think my uh, reasoning behind not using them was. All right, Zodiac, here we go. I know Zodiac is good. I have used him before. Ooh, that was, that was pretty good. So he has, it looks like he has at least Protect up. I'll have to look at other stuff. He's got Renew. He's got Scathe. Uh, massive damage to all foes. He's got Haste Gun. That's really quite good. Uh, and then Banish Ray with his normal attack. This will definitely kill him. Let's do Final Eclipse here. Can I see? I wanted to see if I could... Um, Okay, yeah, yeah, I can see it there. So he has Protect, Shell, Haste, Faith, and Libra. That's pretty buffed. I didn't do that on some of the other ones. That's disappointing, but... All right, Zodiac, do this. I think this is the only other one I've, I have used. Of course, when I say that, it doesn't mean I use a lot, but I've at least seen his. This one's 
that's quite good. creative, that's for sure. Wow. That did 60,000 damage. Now that one was worth it. Now, is that all of them? Let's see. I'm pretty sure that's it. So that's six. What am I doing? Seven, eight, nine. Ten, eleven. Twelve, thirteen. Yeah, that's all thirteen espers. Okay, so that's the showcase. Um, yeah, it's again, it's kind of unfortunate that we weren't able to really incorporate more of those into the gameplay that we have have done this entire time they are absolutely cool um and i know that people that are probably smarter than me come up with better ways to utilize their powers um i just wish i could see uh, see them in, in action more um when you get the weapons that we have currently especially since i mean obviously i have the, the great Trango, so obviously, you know, that's ridiculously overpowered, especially when you combined it with that shield, with the, what is it, Zodi Zodiac uh, Echelon, that shield, between that and this, he's ridiculous, plus he can use all the really good weapons, we've got a Zodiac Spear, we've got the Mithuna, which is the top gun, top gun, <laughs> um, Oh, he's still got the tree blade on. That's actually kind of funny. Okay, we definitely don't want that. I'll fix that, whatever. Uh, yeah, y Yagu Dark Blade. I know I said Yagata a lot. It's because in 11, they're Yagatu, um, like, beastmen. So I just was saying the wrong thing, so I apologize for that. But anyways, it's Yagu Dark Blade. Uh, she's got the Worm Hero Blade, which is one of the top blades you could possibly get. And she has the Dan Dan what is it? Dansha Dan Danusha Danusha with Artemis here. I mean, we've got such ridiculously high power. I mean, do we even need summons at certain point? You know, so that's kind of the, what I always battle with in my head, and it's just like, why even bother? So, in any event, um, I do hope you enjoyed the showcase. Um, and I will definitely, hopefully, see you in the next episode. Have a great day.